fire in a hole. Woo! Let's go to the intro! the channel. Now in this video my friend and I will be making a potato cannon. I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you subscribe right now I'll give you a shout out in my next video. Thank you for your guys support and um, let's make this. So I'm first going to start out with a, little, with a little piece of sewage pipe and I'm going to put a threaded insert fitting on the end of that. Now in the end of the, um, the cap I've just drilled a hole just for a regular fire lighter to fit through. Um, I've got my pipe glue um, and I've also got a, um, a socket reducer um, and I've got my 50 mil pipe and I put a screw in the end so the projectile cannot go into the um, sewage pipe um, and I've also got my aerostat and um, let's start gluing it. So we're first going to start out with putting this little um, cap piece on the sewage pipe. Thank you. 
and a half. Would even be able to catch that. That was so fast. Well, let's move on to the next test. Now we're going to get the um, potato gun to shoot that target over there. And uh, I'm not sure how the accuracy is going to be, but hopefully I'll be able to hit that target from over here. So. Thing. Look at that dent. Here's the potato. <laughs> Broke the potato. Look at that. That has some power. All right, let's move on to the last and final test. Last test is the height. Three, two, one, fire in the hole. That is awesome! <laughs> this potato cannon turned out unbelievably amazing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I couldn't have done this without my friend and fellow YouTuber Willem from Willem Games. Make sure you go check out his YouTube channel and subscribe to it. The links will be in the description. Also, if you haven't seen how to make a hydrogen generator on my YouTube channel, the link will also be in the description. Um, again, do not try this at home, and uh, you'll see me on the next video.